here with the champ, Terrence Bud Crawford in Omaha. We've done this about, what, four times yeah. now. We're back again in your hometown. But, but you train over in Colorado Springs, Colorado. We didn't have a chance to check you out in training camp, but how did it go this time in preparation for Dierry Jean? It went great. It went excellent. You know, uh, we're going to be ready for whatever you bring to the table. It seems like you're already on weight. I talked to a few members of the team, and they just said there's just been a, a little more fire, you know, this time around, which a lot of people wouldn't anticipate because you're such a heavy favorite in this fight. Why do you think that is so? Because I always feel like everybody got something to prove, and I don't want to never take nobody lightly. Is that how you kind of get yourself up for this fight? Because looking at the odds, everyone's like, God, he's such a heavy favorite. He's going to walk past this guy already talking about maybe a fight with Pacquiao or whatever's in your future. But you never look too far ahead. But still, how do you get motivated for a guy that you're such a heavy favorite against? Because I'm fighting. You still got to win the fight. So that's how I get motivated. Your opponent has sparred with Manny Pacquiao, prepared him for Mayweather. They said his style is kind of similar. Um, but he said that he knows that Pacquiao hits harder and is faster than you. So he's not really concerned about what you bring to the table. What do you think about that? Well, we're going to have to see about all that. I didn't fought two people. That was Manny Pacquiao sparring partners, and we all know what happened. So, Which gonna, is what? Go ahead and tell the people. <laughs> which is I won, and we're going to see come time Saturday. <laughs> now, as you prepare for this fight, obviously your opponent is going to come with all that he can. He sparred southpaws. He sparred orthodox fighters. And he's known to come on strong in the beginning of fights, but as he kind of did in the Lamont Peterson and a few others, he fades kind of a little bit in the middle rounds. Whereas you're a little bit of a slow starter in terms of kind of figuring out your opponent and then you turn it on. Uh, do you think that he could steal some rounds there early if, if you're not careful? Are we ready. <laughs> we ready for whatever he's going to bring. We ready. All right. More from Terrence Crawford this week, all fight week long. Keep it right here on TopRank.com. Not too much from the champ. He's, he's in fight mode already. Thank you, Terrence. Lastly, uh, why should everybody get tickets if they haven't? Because Omaha's a great place to watch a fight. Everybody should get tickets because it's a great atmosphere. And it's, I'm going to put on a great show. All right, HBO, it's going down. Thanks, Terrence. Thank you. All right.